In this demonstration, I'm going to go over the design of the Alex Amara Marina Group database that we'll be using in class. Now this company owns and manages multiple marinas. So we have a marina table. And that marina table has a marina number to uniquely identify that marina, its name, address, city, state, and zip to describe that marina. We have a marina slip to track each parking stall in the marina. We have a slip ID to uniquely identify it. The marina number ties it to which marina that slip is at. The slip number length is how long of a boat can it handle or how long of a boat is in that slip. The rental fee, how much is the owner paying to store their boat there the boat type, and an owner number to tie it to the owner's table. In the owner table, we uniquely identify each owner through an owner, owner number. Then we have their information, their last name, first name, city, state, and zip. Now each time a boat needs service, we put in a service request. To uniquely identify that, we have our service ID. The slip ID ties it to the boat that is going to be serviced to our service category table. We have a description of the service, the status of that service, estimated hours to complete it, how many hours were spent on it, and when that service is due to be done again. In our service category table, we uniquely identify each category with a category number, and then we give it a description. And that is the design of the Alex Amara Marina Group database.